Welcome back to the Guru. Today I'm going to show you how to transfer drive documents from one user to another. Now there are a couple ways to do this, so I'm going to go through each one. The first is on an individual basis. So these are documents that you already own. What you do is you go into your drive, find the document, and these documents should already be shared with the user. And all you have to do is highlight the document, go up to this share icon in the top right, click advanced, and then next to the name of the person who the document is shared with, you can change this from can edit to is owner. Now you click save changes. Now I'm going to hold on to this document, so I'm not going to click that, and I'll click cancel. But you can also select multiple documents at a time and go through the same steps. But sometimes, as an admin of a domain, you need to transfer documents that don't necessarily belong to you. For instance, if a user is leaving your domain, you may want to transfer all of their documents to another user. So there's also two ways to do this. The first is in the admin console. So in the admin console, we'll go to Apps, Google Apps, Drive, and then Transfer Ownership. Now this allows you to transfer all of the documents from one user to another user. So you type the user's name in this first line, who owns all the documents, and then on the second line you would type in the name of the user whom you'd like to transfer the files to. And then you click Transfer Files. But since this does all the files at once, it is not useful for every situation. Sometimes you need to transfer just one or two files from one user to another. In order to do this, you need to use the third-party app, BetterCloud. So let's go into BetterCloud and see how this is done. So in BetterCloud, we'll go up to Google Apps. Under Drive, we'll go to Audit. And then as you can see here, there's a list of all the documents on our drive. It doesn't matter who owns these now, because all you need to do is select the document. And just a little reminder, you can search for documents up here, because it's kind of hard to pick them out of a big list like this. And then under this Edit Permissions drop-down, click Change Owner. And then we can put in the name of the user we'd like to transfer the ownership to. And then we can decide what will happen to the previous owner. They could be an editor, a viewer, or we could just remove them entirely from the document. And we can choose to email the new owner about this change. And then we'd click Update, and the documents are transferred. I hope you found this tip to be helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. Thank you, and have a great day.